mind to introduce myself? Uh, my name is Dee, uh, Dee Stewart. For about a decade now, I've been working um, in Froctor. Um, I have um, eight children, two are in the military, and um, I've always just enjoyed creating and, and expressing myself through colors. <laughs> In second grade, I could do good bubble letters, <laughs> and um, and and I remember um, that just being something that I was comfortable with and that um, was easy for me and enjoyable. So um, you know, it just went from there, and eventually, as as a stay-at-home mom, um, I found um, creation um, just relaxing. Uh, folk art started with quilts and the colors and sewing and. And um, I had an aunt that exposed me to cross stitch and um, painted slate and anything that I could find really that was laying around that would keep my interest and, and um, start um, just expressing myself and my way of um, having a little bit of a life among the children. An eagle is pretty common in the Froctor. Um, which would be like the 1750s to 1850s. It's a, a Pennsylvania German style um, of work where I really am based. Thank the Lord that we get to live in a wonderful country like America and there have been so many people who have um, given their lives um, to allow that and bless us that way. Um, and I've always been very grateful um, for the veterans and, and what they've done for us. So I was asked to create a piece um, by uh, actually my printer that would benefit the military and um, having two boys in the military um, you know I jumped at the chance and decided to uh, try my hand at it and um, it was accepted well so I did the piece in um, in a few weeks um, we, we raised uh, close to five hundred dollars and um, since then have sold another wrapped piece and added hundred and twenty five dollars the monies raised uh, are going to the veterans um, in that way. I am actually uh, have another copy and have framed a copy. As I sell more, I think I'm going to give choices of um, people who would buy a copy of the piece if they would like it to go to some other uh, worthwhile organizations like um, um, Pennsylvania Wounded Warriors and the Hero Walkers and um, um, the National Vietnam Veterans Foundation. Um, wherever, if, if someone has something close to their heart, you know, I'd be happy um, to make a donation. What I want people to, to take away when they look at my art, I hope that they get a piece of history and um, I hope they take away some whimsy and imagination and joy.